Yeah, Bunko. I don't even think they, they, they stage struck. I think they nope. just like get Battlefield. Yeah. Yeah. No, they wanted to get right into it. Bunko choosing Falcon hasn't gone Falcon a lot in this matchup. Uh, traditionally, he's gone Sheik as his uh, secondary for this. But maybe he's still there's a confident with the main. Maybe he's just warmed up with Falcon. True, true. Yeah, we might see a switch if things keep going this way. Dip with the first stock advantage right here. Gets the dare. Knee. Back air. Ooh. Up throw. Nair. Ooh. Back air. No huge combos, just uh, scraps most of the, mostly this first stock. True, true. Oh, try to get that like oh. low hit in there right there. I don't know if you saw. But gets the grab here. Oh, he's looking for the knee. That's one of the areas as Falcon where you're really like uh, shaken up by like the Falco DIing. Very oh, rare. Mm. that was supposed to be a laser, I assume. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I don't think Bunko was trying to down B in any sense. But uh, the uh, drop down back air there going to provide dip with some uh, some better uh, leverage here. 122, yeah, this is basically it. Bunko just needs to clean it up. Falcon with one more opportunity. Dip cleans it up. And, oh. Oh, yeah. the fade back almost worked. Yep, almost, but uh, too high a percent. Oh, oh, three piece. Oh. Not kind of hesitated for that up air. Does not get the regular knee again. Flash couldn't Falcon punish it. coming through right now. Now, for y'all at home who uh, don't know the term, I call it flaccid falcon when the knees keep, like, not hitting. <laughs> like, it just, like, you're like, okay, like soft keys. knee. Oh, shit, soft knee. And it's just like, I read that for a kill, and now I got to keep going, you know. I mean, it's, it's soft knee is not a bad move on its own. It's just, it's oh, well, I thought I, thought I was going to get the best move, you know. But it's so much better off stage. I feel. Be it's, like, not good against crouch cancel. Kind of like, like a, a, a Jigglypuff fair kind of hit. Yeah, 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 in that way, where it's like good off stage, not so good. Uh, just when you on just need to push them off a little further yeah. without giving them the chance to like DI up and then go over again, kind of thing. Exactly. Like keep them in hit stun. Almost. But yeah, keep, keep them in, in hit stun, but also you get the uh, get a really good angle and you uh, can combo in an up air to to really. Uh, because off is like is the ending hitbox, so it's yeah. You know, only a couple frames before you're actionable again. True, true. <gasps> Another SD. Yeah, and all of a sudden, Bunko back in it. 100% good ledge play here by Bunko. I think even if he wins, we might see the Sheik after this. Ooh, who knows, actually. Bunko playing it pretty well. Down B. This is still doable. Kind of want to set yourself up, though, for a tech scenario when you have that close uh, stage. Mm -hmm. uh, because you've already been going high, so the Falco is not expecting that first tech. Uh, but uh, nonetheless, Bunko was uh, was trying for stage, uh, noticing that Dip was uh, messing up a little, but it uh, doesn't come into favor for him. Probably Dreamland, I'd assume? I think Dreamland traditionally is the counterpick. See, I actually, I have a hot take. I don't think this is Falcon's best stage. Just because, like, Falco has so much room to pillar you. Mm, yeah. Like, when Falco's combos are going, right, they're going on for a long time on this stage. Like, they're just, they seem, like, pretty endless. Uh, All, yeah, also, his, uh, his full hop goes so high, you can get to the top platform a lot easier than most characters. True, true. See, I think it's good against, like, Fox. I think it's good. It's more a, a, a Fox counter pick. Um... Even then, it's hard. I actually don't mind low key. This is also a hot take. I don't mind. Uh, I think Squid the Cat is a proponent of this, but Yoshi's actually pretty good low key. Because you just. Right, yeah. You both just combo the shit out of each other, but Falco doesn't have all that room for like lasers. Yeah, oh, true, true. And also the fact you have a wall jump for your recovery, and Falco's gonna die like really early to knee. Patiently waited around that pressure, but it yep. didn't pay off. Oh. The, the one thing is, though, Dip, I don't think, I think this is probably his weakest stage. I really like Yoshi's story, so that's probably why this was picked. So in this scenario, now that I'm thinking about it more, like, given Dip's playstyle, it might be more like half counter pick, half like, just, oh, Dip's not the best. Right, right. On this stage. It's a player counter pick. Yeah. 
I mean, it also is a tradition kind of thing, but that you know, would frame. There's multiple mind. factors. Yeah. Yeah. And you have to you know, care about both of them when you're stage picking. Good job there by Bunko. Was uh, pulling this one technique to uh, not get flushed by the lasers where uh, you have enough room to uh, to wave dash down and away uh, when you get hit by lasers. Uh, that way you're you're already, you know, showing a little bit of fight back. Like, okay, I'm not going to be in, the, in this exact spot. That creates just enough doubt to where I think Melee, like, has a lot of split-second decisions. An underrated part of playing the game. And just you don't so really many see when small you, things you, you can slot into your game. Then, yeah, they're just like in these split. Like uh, there are yeah. multiple different mix-ups you could do off just take laser. True, but I'm I'm talking more about like mixing up opponents' heads. Like it's so hard to like think about the game just because you slip up with the wrong info for the wrong second, and that could make a huge difference. Right. Like you're just like oh you know. When uh, and I think this is actually why like a character like uh, like Falcon sometimes can be harder to play than he looks is like you have a lot of decisions that are right. down to like oh if my cre my opponent creates enough doubt in my head I'm gonna be slow to react in this certain situation. Right. Yeah. Fast so is just have to, just have to just quantity of yeah. decisions they need to make over the course of the game and he doesn't have the panic button of just press shine either that yeah. the other fast fallers have. Exactly. You don't really have that like defined shield pressure uh, or like defined like this this goes into this mm -hmm. uh, it's all you have to be creative with it and with your spacing and you have to be and to get you know, even to the shield you're like oh yeah. I'm Captain Talk I'm probably like, flying towards him I have to be careful of my yeah. air momentum as well true and to, to respect also Falco I feel like Falco uh, against especially floaties can fall into that category too where uh, you just gotta really have your reads right Ooh. Shines. Forward air. Forward throw. Beautiful okay. extension. Yeah, dip heating up right now. 36% now on Bunko. 50%. Does not, yeah, does not get the back air off. Good late up air. But doesn't get anything off at all. Oh, so much respect yeah. after that soft knee hit. Yeah, that laser reset. Oh, does not get the knee. Was looking for uh, the hitboxes to trade. But the oh, the Bunko! The trademark, but he Oh! And it wouldn't even matter because Falco made the stage. Life of a Falcon. Life of a Falcon sometimes. Yeah, there was nothing else because he was, uh, he kind of had to be there, yeah. So yeah, he forced so into it. Now Bunko, because of that loss, uh, going to the Sheik right now, going to Battlefield. All right, yeah, makes sense. He, yeah, I think uh, last game, uh, Dip was doing a good job of using Falco's lasers to disrupt Captain Falcon double jumps way off stage. Yeah. That's frustrating for Captain Falcon. So like, well, I, yeah, I... Okay, yeah. add needles to that. I'll be like, you know what? I, I have needles at least. Oh, yeah. So now he can come down from above a little, you know, more disjointedly, I guess. Yeah. Pressure his shield from afar a bit. Oh, I like that panel smash. Right in the face. Now Dip... Down three stocks to four. At 20%. Bunko's doing a, just a good job of shielding all of Dip's hits, really. Yeah. Oh. Oh, and that is going to be knew stock. that side B was coming out. Four stocks to oh, two. Oh, good double poof. And now uh, Dip, all of a sudden, down pretty significantly. Has to get a kill here. And like the down smash does get the up smash. That's not Fox. Down air. 143%. The fair going to do it. Dip up. Or dip closing the gap. <laughs> yeah. Funko is still up a stock. Yeah, but that But yeah, that can uh, that can be evaporated pretty quickly against Falco. Usually you don't have want a Falco really you, but yeah. Funko is having some success there. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, oh. Dip was having a hard time getting off the platform. Oh. Good shine there. Fair. Yeah, a little bit of flubs there from Dip. Oh, oh. double back air is going to do it. It's now three stocks to one here. Needles. Good there. Sh double shine. Down air. The eye. And panic and hold full right and just die off the side to it. Dare. Oh. 
Hey, he's just looking for Bunko to go to center stage, but it's really not. He keeps looking for Bunko to do a panic option. Yeah. And Bunko's just refusing to do that. The day one roll in. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's the uh, the thing that happens sometimes uh, when you get desperate against uh, players who are patient enough, good enough to like not overreact. I feel like there's this state where you're like hopelessly throwing out moves mm -hmm. and you're just like, please hit, and like none of them hit, and it's just it's so fun. It's it's the the comedy of my, of my <laughs> comedy of my melee set, comedy of my melee career. All right, well that's a little reversal of momentum. Yeah. Yeah, Dip uh, gets two on his counter pick, though. Yep. Dip still has some counter picks, but Bunko uh, almost confidently, like, yeah, I could I, I could reverse three with the Sheik. Uh, so we'll see how this game four turns out. If I'm Dip, I want to close him out right here. Right, yeah, don't let this go to a game five, because especially if Bunko's going to play this patiently. True. Bear. Down air. Could shine. Down air. Down smash. He's yeah. going to do it. So now Bunko is probably expecting a, another shine there. Yeah. Four stocks to three right now. Down throw. Laser. Down throw and just back out of the situation and shoot a laser. Yeah. Down air. Forward throw into the down air. Up tilt. Just a retreating down air at a shield that Bunko didn't take. Cause that five hit combo. Ooh. Damn. Falco can be brutal sometimes if you're just not. Oh no, not the 69. Yep, that's unfortunate. 69 Lost the bonus. I mean, you're talking about San Diego, folks. But uh, the forward smash into the down air. Just getting straight hits his dip, but not really leading to much in terms of combos. But does get that back air there. 83%, 91%. Just keeps winning neutral is dip. Dip. Ooh, down smash. Lasers holding a three stocks to two lead here, 64% on him. Bunko's trying his hardest to battle on the stage, but. Oh, and now you're on the other side of the track. Yeah, okay. A little bit of solace, but. Doesn't Ooh, matter. Did not want that trade at all. Yeah, trade working out for dip. And now dip's up three stocks to one. Good shine pressure there. It doesn't lead to anything. Ooh, up air. Was it for the dare? Into the it's so fair. tempting as Sheik to like, oh, Falco's up there. I can just kind of full hop up air and get him before the down air comes out. It's so tempting. But it, it, it worked for Bungo there, but it does not usually work for the Sheik. Yeah, back air is going to do it. So now two stocks to one, but Bunko's still on tournament stock right here. Up throw. There. Oh. Let's see. At this point, is Falco, yeah, just tech chase. Get the get a stray hit. Watch. Try to read where Bunko techs. True. Down tilt. Oh. oh. Trade working out for Dip. Dip takes it. Three. Yeah. Three. Good shown by Dip. Uh, let's see. Was that uh, Losers Finals? Hmm. This, is this Grands? Gaming. 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 Oh, I think I saw a Trie walk up to stage, so this might be Grand Finals, uh, the run back. No, they didn't play bracket. Did they? Oh, they did. So this is the run back. Yep. They're going to game.